Hello everybody, this is Eddie. Rob. And we are playing... That's right. Uh, Showbird is a game by MainMarion.com. It is a free MMORPG. Indeed it is. Yep, and... Um, Isn't that just dandy? Uh, it's been around for a very long time. Uh, whoops. Yeah, so here's what you can, how you play. <laughs> Arrow keys and whatnot. Uh, so yeah, it's been a long, it's been around for a uh, very long time. Mm -hmm. uh, we've been, I've been playing this on and off for like, pro hey, probably like I ten was a years. Young lad. Probably like ten years or something. What? Maybe a little less. Maybe like five. <laughs> no. Yeah. Well, whatever. Trust. Whatever. Uh, so uh, yeah, it's pretty simple. You know, there's not much to it. Uh, it's fighting. You gotta fight some monsters. Where are you? Yes. Join the Ruby oh, Scrapper. Oh, I'm gonna join the 77. No. Well, I I'm wasn't in the same room as you, so I did join in 77. Um, join. Yeah. So yeah, it's like a fighting game. Nice. This this is like. Join 77. You got it. Where are you? Let's take it. There you are. There are you. Plop. Yeah, you can dance. You can dance if you want to. You can leave uh, your friends behind. <laughs> Alright. Um, so, we recorded like a bunch of us when we started out again. Um, oh, I should mention first though. You don't really need to make... A, well, you don't need to make an account with Maid Marian to play this game. It is free. And I think there are free accounts though. But, um... You... It just like... Uh, it, it uses Shockwave, and it just like yeah, it just saves your computer, and then you can just like type in what you want your username to be displayed as, and then it can be that. Um, so we did have some pretty sick characters stored up on some old computers, but we don't have those anymore. So we've just been we recorded us for a while playing again fresh, but uh, we had some issues with audio and. Stuff, stuff like, like that. that, yeah. And it was really boring when we were low levels. That's right. So. But then we did a quest. We're starting again, and yeah, we now realize that. Look at this guy. He's gone through his own pet wolf. I think you have to pay for these pets. Mm -hmm. You do. Looks like he's riding it, or like he's in one of those Halloween costumes where. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so um, Whoa. I I say before we start a new quest. Well, there's two different kinds of quests. There's simple quests, where they just say, go kill X amount of such and such an enemy. In the dungeon. And in the dungeon or something like that. Or or just around uh, some area. And uh, you kill them, and then they give you like a reward of some sort, like a weapon. Um, and then there's the other kind of quest, which is like bringing letters from one person to another and then having that person tell you various things. And I think before we start a big quest, which is what our videos are going to be about, I think we should fight each other and show off all the moves we have and stuff in the arena. Why don't we just do it in the right there, where you are? I don't think we can hurt each other in here. Yeah, we can. Pretty well, sure. But, but, uh, that, but that's not as fun. And there's a slash teleport. No, just, if you press escape eight. and then just do teleport to another location, you can do battle arena. Is and it uh this checker board thing. Yep. There you are. Hi. So I do, do join what 77. Makes it fun. We're in there. Just making sure because, you know, if someone joins the battle arena, you don't want them to interrupt. Where are you? So I'm on the red team. So are you? How do you, how do you think you change teams? Yeah, yeah ready? Oh, are you, ch are you changing Ooh. to blue? All right. First off, no potions. Okay. I mean, I don't think this is going to be an actual fight. I think you should just go through your move list on me. Alright, ready? Alright, try to get a good angle. One then. is just yeah, straight so attack. Yeah. Two is block. Three is amulet, and I have a fire amulet. And I have a darkness amulet, which turns them to metal. They both, they all do the same thing, I think. And then I, this is a nice kick to the face. And I'll do number five. Uh, which is uh, super slash. This is six, the behind the back slash. Very cool. And then 
the highest I think both of us have is seven, which is like a spinny kick. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, fight to the death. Damn it. Did that hurt you? No, I missed you too. Uh oh, I think you got me. Did you use a potion? No. Yeah, you did. No, I didn't. I think your health went up. No, I nah. didn't use a potion. Alright, whatever. Alright, so I we think we found a quest. Oh, it's on. I'm gonna get you. No, you're not. Not if I run in circles. Fine. Yeah, Alright. So let's head back to Sherwood Castle. This is like the main area. And, uh, there are usually enemies here, but Where I think you? they only spawn when are you're you nearby. One? Yeah, I'll go yeah. into seven. Oh. I'll go into no. seven. We like to join room 77. So that we, there's no one else around. There actually is quite but a lot of people here. In Ruby, there's always a ton of people. But in Emerald, there's no I wonder anybody. why. Oh, there's somebody on a horse. Yeah, that's that's a pretty sick thing. I think you can buy that. Okay, so um, we did one big quest, which was like collecting a bunch of things from people in all different areas, uh, and then then what did we do? Oh, and then we put them together and made like a actually, scepter. I'm I'm wielding it right now. It's the no, it's the ball no. thing. There, you can kind of see it when I'm dancing. And uh, that uh, that was used to kill a giant dragon. Um, let me change my color back. I'm gonna change it to black. Actually, yeah. all right. Anyways, so let's see. Big trouble in Midnight Glade. What? That's that's the question I got. No, I have a different. You got one. a different one? I probably already did that one right at the beginning. Just do that real quick. All right, I'll, yeah, I'll see if I can do it quickly. Big trouble in Midnight Glade. Our struggle against the Dark Blood, which is like the enemies that are human, <coughs> are like they're like bandits and knights and stuff. There's various different Dark Blood enemies, but anyways, our struggle against the Dark Blood is getting desperate. It's been weeks since we've received a shipment of weapons and supplies from Midnight Glade. I need someone to make the journey and find out what the trouble is. Guess that someone's gonna be me and me alone. Deliver this letter to the supply sergeant in Midnight Glade. You'll find him right in front of the shop near the fountain. You will be teleported there automatically when you accept this quest. Don't lose the letter. That should be Maybe we have different pretty quests. easy. I think we do have different that quests. Would be very difficult. Yeah, that would be. Although I I suppose we could scroll through it. Scroll, like, just keep declining them until the right one came out. But I'll just finish no, this one. Five out. bonus experience. Thanks for the letter. Unfortunately, I don't have good news. Uh, our efforts to resupply Sherwood Castle are in trouble. Darkblood bandits have completely cut our supply line by raiding caravans along the trade routes, leaving Midnight Glade. The town itself is now in grave danger of being overrun. We need knights to bring the fight to the Darkblood so the shipments can get through. We really need your help. If you can thin out the number of bandits, we should be able to resume shipments to Sherwood. Defeat ten of the Dark Blood bandits, and I will reward you with a curved axe. Actually, that does like, quite a bit of damage. That's pretty cool. Alright, I will accept that. Challenge accepted. And I will fight some bandits. Let's hope the sound in this video worked out. Hopefully. Oh, it's going to be a close one. Oh, ah. Oh. Ah, oh, he got me with a super hit. Some kind of special move, I guess. No problem, I've weakened him. Yes, got him. I don't think I had to collect anything from him. Oh, timber wolves. Wolves? Wolves? How do you, how do you pluralize wolf? Wolves. Wolves? Wolf? Mm -hmm. Wolves? Ah, they were both attacking me. Died pretty easily. That looks a little weird. All right. 
Also, me and Robbie have been measuring how good we are by fighting unicorns because for some reason they are just the most kick-ass. Where I, I am, there are black unicorns which are just completely awesome looking and destroy me. I think I've seen that. Quickly. And it won't stop attacking me. Sorry, bit of an interruption. We're back. And when we were gone, I got a little something for you. Believe it or not, I got you a gift. Awesome. I didn't buy it for you. You're not that worthy. No offense. Still searching for the best place to kill these. Uh, um. Alright, here we go. Oh, I've got two. Oh, you're not in my Yeah, no, you gotta be in the same area as me. I'll be there in a minute, man. I don't think I've ever been to the area that you are in. This is the first time I've ever been here. Hmm. Isn't that so interesting? That is very interesting. Can't find any of these bandit guys. I think if I s oh, there we go. You stand still, the right kind of enemy. Oops. Alright, where are you at? Mm. There we go. Uh, I'm over here fighting. A club. Why, thank you, Robbie. You're welcome. Cleaver. You're just really giving me so many gifts here, aren't you? Yes, Ooh, this is close. Ah, he killed me. Oh, you're bad. Well, I'm dead. I will inspect my weapons. See if these are better than the ones you gave me. Probably. No, the I ones you gave me are better. Because I gave them to you. It just makes them that much better. It's much better than the Dragon Claw Scepter. I don't think we need that anymore because we're not fighting dragons. I don't think it wouldn't even have mattered if we had used it or not. No, it, it definitely did. Because I remember before I remembered to equip it, I was doing <coughs> really bad. Take a cleaver, why not? Thrusting and slashing. Cleaving. Alright, let's head back over to that area where all of those guys were.